Good evening then and welcome to our LUTV coverage on the uh, prestigious night of the FA Youth Cup. The game delayed from uh, last week after that uh, frozen uh, pitch conditions. The team for Leeds is uh, Daryl Omba, Cuba Diva, Connor Ferguson, Charlie Crew, James DeBio, Jay Buchan, Connor Douglas, Kian Coleman, Ben Andrucci, Max McFadden and Marley Wilson. Extend the subs of uh, Rory Mahardy, Ruben Lapata white Ronnie McGrath, Dan Tolson, Joe Richards, Alfie Cresswell, and then Leighton Brown. As for Accrington, they go with Clayton, Monk, Newton, Hall, Pickles, Young, Henderson, Polili, Massey, Trickett, and Harper. Their bench is Reva, Kelly, Lawton, Smith, Devonport, Goff, and Proctor. Leeds have got to really stand up and fight for this. Is Ferguson? Gets back, now jockeys to try and stop the shot coming in, which has found its way through and in. And Accrington lead on the way that they've been building up. It isn't a shock with the way they've gone early with the uh, the strike towards goal. And just as we said, they'll be desperate to beat Leeds United tonight on their turf. And with that start and that effort, you can understand why they deserve to lead, Ben. It's uh, a goal from Jack Massey and Leeds have got it all to do. Forward it goes and into Harper again, free from goal, towards goal. It's a peach of an effort. And Atkinson stand the lead by two goals to nil. And Calvin Harper, who has been a constant pain in Leeds' side, gets the second goal. Tremendous finish, but from a Leeds perspective, wide open between two centre backs with the full view of goal. Yeah, here is Douglas to try and attack Wilson. Joins in, now Wilson takes control, needs to get the ball under his feet and he's uh, chopped to the ground on the edge of the box. A free kick for Leeds, Wilson's felt the effects of that, we hope he's okay. Awkward for a cross, so what can he do? He tries to curl it, deflected, the keeper's been wrong-sighted and there is the moment of joy that Leeds United need. Leeds 1, Accrington 2. You will, do, you will not find a better time goal in this cup competition. They've been down, they've been really frustrated there's a real moment for them to kick on now in the second half. Corner drilled in, flicked on, and it's in. What a header, what a header from Marley Wilson, near post, steers it home, and uses the power of the cross to guide it. And the players all on the same page this time. Camaraderie, teamwork, everything you want to see. Game on at Thorpe Arch, Leeds United 2, Accrington 2. And wide towards McGrath. McGrath's turned inside. What a touch that is now. Can he pick a chance to shoot? McGrath still going. Lays it across to McFadden. He goes to ground. It's from behind. And the referee gives the penalty. And Rory McGrath celebrates as if he's won the game for Leeds United. Andrucci sends the keeper the wrong way and scores the goal for Leeds United. Celebrates in front of the camera crew. Leeds United 3, Accrington 2. The comeback is complete. It's Ferguson forces the mistake. And I'm sure if anyone in that Leeds United bench has got some sense about them, they will hold up possession, but they don't need to hold it up much longer because Scott Gardner's men have pulled off a fantastic comeback at Thorpe Arch for 25 minutes. The way they were playing suggest they were on their way out of the FA Youth Cup third round. They were disjointed. They didn't play with any cohesion. They looked like they just met on some of them. But then after that first goal from McFadden, after goals from Harper and Massey, the Leeds United are in under 18 showcased exactly what they're all about. Camaraderie, sticking up for each other and showing their true class in possession. And with a bit of chip on their shoulders, they've managed to come back thanks to goals from McFadden, Wilson's bullet header and Andrucci's 90 minute penalty 